National Nutrition Interviews. The natural health experts, up close and personal. Introducing naturopathic doctor Ludo Brunel. He's a natural health expert and product formulator for preferred nutrition, the maker of Canada's most popular hormone support supplements. Dr. Brunel has formulated over 100 natural health products while at the same time developing a thriving clinical practice in Calgary. He also gives back through a number of nonprofit medical oriented organizations and has helped tens of thousands of people live healthier and happier lives through his expert clinical potency formulations. He's also a National Nutrition Interview guest. My name is Ludovic Brunel. I'm a naturopathic doctor. I work as a medical consultant. I help companies market products and get them regulated with Health Canada. I'm also a formulator for products and I own a practice and I work for a um, wellness program where I see patients. I decided to become a medical practitioner a long time ago now. I, uh, I was quite a sick teenager and through my own health journey I, become, I became quite passionate about health and quickly realized that um, the medical system often failed to provide me with um, time and options that I needed in order to improve my own health and uh, naturopathic medicine was a good fit for me in that sense um, where I get to spend more time with my patients, educate them and give them the tools that they need to take better care of themselves. I love being a naturopathic doctor for a few reasons. The main one being that I get to help people, help them um, maximize their health and improve how they feel and uh, enhance their quality of life. I also love the interaction with people. I'm also passionate about research and I love um, educating myself, reviewing literature and looking at the best possible treatments for the patient. So I think there's a few key things when we're looking at formulating a product. Um, I think um, we're looking for ingredients that will be complementary to each other. You're looking for ingredients that are going to be safe, of course, and that are not going to interfere with medication. We're also, we also want to make sure that the mechanism of action is well understood and that the research um, that the product rests on is um, well established to maximize the effectiveness of the product and to help improve the health of the customer. Words in action that um, are really important for myself and my patients um, include uh, being, uh, taking good care of yourself, so um, being proactive when it comes to lifestyle, physical activity, nutrition. Also strongly believe in integrity, so my word is my bond. Um, I'm also dedicated, so with patients, um, I, give, I try to give 100% whenever I can. Well, I'm here to discuss products and inform the public on men's health products and also um, the importance of silicone for health and for collagen production uh, to improve hair, nails, skin and um, also as a treatment for osteoarthritis. I'm a strong believer in dietary supplements for a few reasons. The main one being that since the Industrial Revolution, our diet has become more and more refined, meaning that the nutrient density of our diet has really um, been affected. So for the same amount of calories, we're getting fewer and fewer nutrients. Dietary supplements have the benefit of providing nutrients with very few calories. So they're an excellent aid when it comes to improving the nutrient density of the diet. Specific nutrients can also really help improve health outcomes when people are struggling with their health. So I think that for most people, dietary supplements are going to be a key part of better health and wellness. So Prefer Nutrition is a dietary supplement company that was founded by Dean Parks and that focuses on offering high quality products based on research that are promoted by experts in their fields. Um, and are supported by education and training. The quality of the products, as well as um, the group of people that I work with, um, the company is um, focused on deli delivering quality products to customers, but also making sure that uh, the products stay exclusive to health food stores 
and um, they take very good care of both the customers and the accounts. I think there's a few key differences when it comes to preferred nutrition. I think um, one of them is that the products are promoted by health experts. So uh, the company is divided in different lines that um, are targeted towards certain population, whether that's women's health, men's health. And so I think that um, helps people connect better with the product and access the information that they need um, when it comes to improving their health through dietary supplementation. Ultimate Male Energy is a product that's designed to help improve testosterone production and um, maintain healthy testosterone levels. Testosterone levels tend to decrease with age and lower testosterone is associated with all kinds of symptoms including fatigue, loss of muscle mass, obesity. It also predisposes to health problems like diabetes, for instance. It can also increase the risk of suffering from blood clots and heart disease. It affects memory and mood as well. So for men uh, that are suffering from those symptoms, especially as they get older, uh, the product is really designed to help address those concerns and improve testosterone production in the body. There are several key ingredients in Ultimate Male Energy. Uh, some of them are to address the normal detoxification of hormones. Others are to try to stimulate the production. So uh, nettle, for instance, helps to decrease the production of a protein that binds to testosterone. That's called um, sex hormone binding globulin. And that's one of the key ingredients in the formula. Um, there's also other ingredients that will help to lower inflammation, for instance, uh, turmeric. So one of the key problems that is often seen in clinical practice is fatigue. And if we look at patients that come to a medical doctor, a naturopathic doctor, we can anticipate that about 40% of them will mention fatigue as one of their primary concerns. And with Melanergy, one of the key things that we see is that people feel more energized, feel better overall. Um, it helps improve their moods and um, how they feel overall. Adrenosense is a product that's targeted towards improving adrenal function. Uh, adrenal function is really important. Uh, in our busy modern life, a lot of us are suffering from chronic stress and fatigue, uh, also problems with depression and mood. And um, the ingredients in Adrenosense really try to improve functioning of the adrenal glands, which help us cope better with stress. So essentially what the product does is it tries to maximize our energy stores so that we're better prepared to uh, face stress. So some of the key ingredients in Adrenosense um, are called adaptogens. Adaptogens are usually plants and essentially what they do is they help to improve the function of the adrenals and maximize energy production. Uh, so some of those include Siberian ginseng, which has been uh, used in athletes to help to improve performance and to prevent exhaustion. Other ingredients that are interesting include ashwagandha, which similarly um, has been used to improve performance in athletes and rhodiola. Rhodiola is probably, in terms of plants, one of the ones that has the most research when it comes to its properties as an adaptogen. So we've used Adrenosense for chronic stress, fatigue, depression. I've also recommended to athletes to help improve how they feel overall, but also their performance. And usually what people report is that they feel better, their energy levels are better, and of course, with athletes, it helps to improve their performance and also reduces their recovery time. So one of the major problems with um, xenoestrogens is that they're chemicals that uh, will mimic the effect of estrogen. And some of them are much more powerful than estrogen itself, and they can latch on to estrogen receptors and stay attached to those receptors for far longer. So they basically mimic the effect of hormones in our body and uh, end up disturbing how um, hormones usually work inside our cells and on, on those specific receptors. 
So if there's an overabundance of xenoestrogens in the body, a few things happen. Um, because they're hormone disruptors, they will increase the risk for hormone-related problems. And that can include things like prostate cancer, breast cancer. They can also affect how a person feels overall. One of the things that's happened over time, for instance, in women, is that women now start having their menstrual cycles earlier on, and we think that's probably related to some of that effect. It's, we also think that it's part of the reason why sperm counts in men have significantly decreased over time. So they essentially disrupt all hormone mechanisms in our body and can really adversely affect our health for that reason. So xenoestrogens can come from different areas. Most of them are derivatives of plastic. So uh, water bottles, for instance, um, have been known to contain some BPA in the past. So most of them are being produced artificially. Some of them will end up in our water. Some were exposed through items that are found um, throughout our environment. But all of them are man-made chemicals. One of the key problems with xenoestrogens is that they're foreign. They're new materials, new chemicals that humans have produced and our body has not evolved with them. And so we lack some of the systems required to effectively get rid of them. And that's why they're so dangerous and that's why trying to avoid the presence of those chemicals and exposure to those chemicals is so important. Women's Sense EstroSense is a product that's designed to help improve the metabolism of estrogen. Estrogen or uh, chronic exposure to high levels of estrogen um, increases the risk of developing health problems like breast cancer for instance, which is the most common cancer right now in Canadian women. One of the things that's happened is um, with the use of contraceptives, women have fewer children. So if we look at women that don't have access to contraceptives, usually they'll have eight to ten children in their life. Uh, women now have one or two children on average, and so what's happened is uh, women experience more exposure to estrogen because with each menstrual cycle, there's a spike in estrogen right before ovulation. And that's really increased the amount of estrogen that women get exposed to, and that's translated to a much higher risk of developing problems such as breast cancer. Where EstroSense is re really beneficial is it helps to improve the metabolism of estrogen to reduce some of those risk factors. So there's um, several key ingredients in EstroSense. Um, one of the ones that's probably the most important is uh, indole-3-carbonyl or I3C. And I3C is basically a plant extract. It comes from cruciferous vegetables. And essentially what it does is it helps to break down estradiol, which is the main um, estrogen that's being produced in women, and it promotes its conversion towards metabolites that are less dangerous. So uh, that's one of the key ingredients in EstroSense. There's other important ingredients, including broccoli extract that contains sulforaphane, and sulforaphane will help to enhance liver detoxification and elimination of estrogen. Another ingredient that's very interesting is calcium deglucurate. That essentially prevents the elimination of estrogen. So we eliminate estrogen by combining it to an acid and there's an enzyme in the body that can cleave that bond. Calcium deglucurate blocks that enzyme and allows for the normal elimination of estrogen. So the product overall helps really decrease the effect of estrogen in the body. I often recommend um, EstroSense for any condition that would be considered um, estrogen dominant. So uh, for instance, women that have painful menstruations, that suffer from PMS, uh, that have fibrocystic breast, for instance, and um, usually patient report that it really helps to improve those conditions. So when people suffer from hypothyroidism, um, they suffer from slow metabolism. Since the thyroid is the master regulator of metabolism, they'll end up feeling tired, they'll feel cold for no reason, they'll start gaining weight for no reason, um, and they'll often feel depressed, they'll lack motivation. It becomes very, very difficult to function because those people are chronically tired. 
So low thyroid function is often missed in terms of a diagnosis. There's a, there's a condition called subclinical hypothyroidism, which means that blood work still looks relatively normal, but the patient is starting to exhibit symptoms. And the majority of those patients will eventually progress to full clinical hypothyroidism, where the blood levels will show marked decreases in thyroid hormones. But at first, often, the level remain normal, although borderline normal. Often patients that suffer from um, subclinical uh, hypothyroidism exhibit symptoms and will really benefit from addressing that condition. Unfortunately, because um, often traditional medicine will focus on blood markers, those patients are not getting the help that they need. So Thyrosense is a natural health product that's designed to help support thyroid function. Um, thyroid function is one of the key problems when it comes to Canadians. A lot of Canadians, especially Canadian women, suffer from hypothyroidism, which is why the number one prescription right now in Canada is Synthroid, which is hormone replacement uh, to help replace the production of thyroid hormones. So Thyrosense contains a variety of ingredients that have been shown to help enhance the production of thyroid hormones. Um, key to that is thyrosine. Thyrosine is an amino acid and it's basically the backbone to thyroxine, which is one of the key hormones that the thyroid gland produces. So it's basically a nutrient that's needed for the production of thyroid hormones. Another ingredient that's interesting is Google and Google has been shown to help the conversion of T4, which is the inactive form of thyroid hormones, into T3, which is the form that our tissues use. And so with the Google, we can make sure that people are able to produce the active form of the thyroid hormones. There's also iodine in the product, and iodine is one of the key molecules or key nutrients needed for the thyroid to be able to produce thyroid hormones. So a deficiency in iodine makes it impossible for us to produce thyroid hormones and in the past is one, it was one of the key reasons why people suffered from hypothyroidism and it led to a lot of um, the Canadian population suffering from goiters. Thyrosense is very safe. Um, it can be used in combination with medication. Often people will feel better when they combine um, traditional medication with a supplement like Thyrosense. One of the reasons being that when people use medication, they're only getting T4. And so if they have a problem converting that T4 to the active T3, a supplement like Thyrosense can make a huge improvement in terms of how they're gonna feel and it'll help to maximize the therapy that they're on. And overall, the product is, uh, has been shown to be very safe. There's no real contraindication to using Thyrosense. So often when there's a hormonal problem, so if the thyroid, the thyroid is not working well, for instance, it will affect other hormonal systems. So the whole endocrine system will be affected. So often combining a product like Thyrosense to another product that will support adrenal health, like Adrenosense, will help people um, improve their health and they'll get better results if they support both the thyroid and the adrenals. So when people suffer from hypothyroidism and they start using supplements like Thyrosense to help improve their thyroid function, they start feeling better. So it helps to improve their metabolism. Um, they start having more energy. Often they'll be able to lose weight. Uh, they'll stop feeling cold for no reason. Their mood will improve. They um, feel more energized overall and they're happier, healthier people overall. Biocil is essentially a highly bioavailable source of silicone that helps to improve collagen production in the body. Collagen is one of the key proteins in our body. It's an essential part of cartilage. It's also really important for skin, hair, nail, uh, really important for our blood vessels as well. Um, collagen production starts to decrease after the age of 21. So if we can help to maximize the health of collagen, we can see all kinds of health benefits. The key research with Biocil has shown that it helps to improve 
um, the strength of hair, so it helps maintain healthy and strong hair. It's also been shown to be extremely effective for arthritis of the knee. So they did a research trial and after 12 weeks there was significant improvements when it came to stiffness, pain, and also um, overall ability to exercise in people that were supplementing with 10 milligrams of biocell per day. Biocell contains a highly bioavailable form of silicone that's called uh, choline stabilized orthosilicic acid and has an absorption of about 17%, so far superior than other silicone supplements. Silicone by itself is usually absorbed 2-3%, and so by improving the absorption, we can maximize the effectiveness of the product. Also, the fact that it's stabilized with choline is um, really interesting. Choline is both water and fat soluble, so it helps to improve the absorption of the molecule. The other key benefit of having choline is that it helps to get rid of a protein that's called homocysteine. And homocysteine affects the production of collagen. So by having choline in the product, it helps to preserve healthy collagen. When patients start using Biocell, often they'll notice that they have stronger nails, um, they'll notice that their skin looks healthier, simply because the Biocell will help to maintain healthy collagen levels. It's also a product that I've used for patients that suffer from arthritis. It's a very common problem, it's very debilitating, and since the product is supported by research, it's one of the key products that I've been recommending for arthritis and patients report significant improvement. So it helps with stiffness and especially pain, which tends to be their number one concern when they suffer from arthritis. Berberine is a plant and it contains a pigment. Um, it's a very strong antioxidant. It's also known for its antimicrobial properties. So traditionally, it's often used for people that end up with infectious diarrhea, for instance, because um, it really helps to slow down uh, gastrointestinal transit time while killing invading uh, microbes uh, like bacteria that would cause gastrointestinal problems. So I'll often recommend berberine when people suffer from gastrointestinal problems, especially if they've um, they got a gastrointestinal infection that leads to diarrhea and they notice very quickly that it helps to calm things down. It, um, it's often a product that I'll recommend for patients that are traveling abroad in case they end up with traveler's diarrhea and it's been very effective for those conditions. So when we look at um, vitamin D deficiency or vitamin D insufficiency, the rates are very high in Canadians. So right now, the average Canadian has a vitamin D level of about 67 nanomoles per liter. If people are regularly exposed to the sun, their blood levels are gonna be around 125 nanomoles per liter, up to 225. So Canadians, again, because of lack of sun exposure, have far lower levels than people that would live near the equator getting regular exposure to, um, to the sun. Now, if we look at people that are below 25 nanomoles per liter, which is a frank vitamin D deficiency where bone health will be compromised, that's about um, one in 20 Canadians. And then if we look at people that are getting the optimal levels of vitamin D, so above 125, that's only about one in 10 currently. So most, most Canadians would really benefit from supplementing with vitamin D to get the full benefits associated with the vitamin. There's a few reasons why vitamin D deficiency is so common in Canadians. And one of the key ones, of course, is that we're far from the equator and so um, we get most of our vitamin D from the sun and um, studies clearly show that during the winter time we're not able to produce vitamin D uh, through sun exposure because the sun has to go through more of the atmosphere before it reaches us and so synthesis of vitamin D is simply not possible during winter months and for that reason Canadians are going to be prone to vitamin D deficiency. The other major problem is that there's not a good food source of vitamin D so it's 
um, essentially impossible to get sufficient D from food alone. We either need to get it from supplements or from sun exposure. So vitamin D has all kinds of health benefits. Of course, it's important for bone health. It's also been shown to help with muscle strength. It reduces the risk of um, fractures because it'll prevent falls and also maintain strong bones. Recently, more and more research has shown benefits for the immune system. And in terms of the immune system, vitamin D helps to balance the immune system. So there's two key aspects of the immune system. And by balancing them, it really helps to decrease the risk of both infections, but also autoimmune disease. More and more research now shows that higher vitamin D levels help, help to prevent things like type 1 diabetes, multiple sclerosis, inflammatory bowel disease, asthma in children, uh, atopic disease, so for instance, uh, eczema on the skin, because of its effect on the immune system. In terms of infection, there's um, good research that's been done in school children that were supplemented with vitamin D and was shown to uh, significantly reduce the incidence of cold and flu infections in those children. In terms of vitamin D supplementation, um, how much is needed will really depend on certain factors. So, um, people that have a higher body weight, for instance, will need a lot more vitamin D to reach the same blood levels. But, on average, most Canadians will need around 4,000 international units or more to get the maximum benefits from vitamin D supplementation. When patients start taking vitamin D, often they'll report feeling better. Um, over time, a lot of patients will say that they're much healthier and less likely to end up with uh, infections. So often they'll say, you know, this year I didn't catch the flu, or I didn't have as many colds as I normally do. A lot of people will feel better. So one of the things that vitamin D helps is mood. So we think that seasonal affective disorder or the winter blues could partially be related to lower vitamin D levels in the winter time. I think health food stores can really help enhance the health of their customers through a variety of um, services that they offer. I think people are always looking for good quality information and um, so that I think that's key, making sure that people can access information so that they can use dietary supplements safely and effectively. I think uh, having well-trained employees that are able to select the appropriate product for the customer is also going to be crucial and also to make sure that um, safety is not, um, is not a problem. So to make sure that the product is going to be safe for that customer as well. So the first thing that I notice about uh, National Nutrition is the wide array of products offered. I think um, when it comes to health food stores, National Nutrition carries a wide spectrum of product and um, at affordable prices. My understanding is that you're a large supplier throughout Canada, that um, your staff is well informed, that you have an amazing distribution network. It sounds like the events are extremely well planned and uh, draw um, a crowd of um, large crowds of people that are very interested with their health. 